So, a very good morning from Incheon Airport. Today is the 24th of August 2024, 11.30 a.m. I will be flying Asian Airlines today, OZ745. Estimated departure time is 7.50 p.m. Departing for Hong Kong with the Boeing 777 And today I'll be flying the business class. So yeah, it's a very good deal, around 2,000 HKD one way from Incheon to Hong Kong. So yeah, very excited to try Asian Airlines for the first time. It's still quite early now, 11.30 a.m., seven hours before departure. But yeah, I will grab a quick lunch, do the tax refund, and do a bit of a plane spotting outside the Incheon airport. Stay tuned and enjoy the video. So it's 4.30 p.m. local time. I'm currently at the Asian Airlines Business Class Lounge near Gate 11 in China Airport Terminal 1. So earlier the immigration process and security was very fast. No queue, so I directly went in. And yeah, the Business Class Lounge here near Gate 11 is nice and cozy, but the food is quite limited compared to Singapore Airlines uh, Silver Plate Lounge uh, in Terminal 2 Changi Airport. It's way different as in Singapore Airlines offers more food. So for this launch, it's for Asian Airlines Business Class passengers and Star Alliance Gold. So it's joint access, I think they have another one for first class passengers beside this place. So yeah, I'll spend some time here before we head to gate 19 later, around 7 p.m. Let's see how it goes, very excited to fly Asian and it's a 777-200. The aircraft flying us to Hong Kong today is a Boeing 777-200ER with the registration of HL7700 delivered to Asian Airlines in May 2002 and currently this aircraft has a configuration of 22 flatbed business class and 278 economy class. This cabin was refurbished in 2017 therefore it's not as old as the aircraft. Thank you. 
So welcome on board on the Asian Airlines Boeing 777-200 Business Plus. PTV screen over here. Flatbed area. Bags will be taken out after takeoff. Shoe compartment. Tray table over here. Safety card. IFE controller, this is the old Panasonic and uh, reclining mechanism headsets I don't think these are noise cancelling but let's see Slippers are also prepared, maybe because this is a night flight. And of course, blanket and pillow. Light is located over here. Yeah, that's it. The headphone jack is located over here, and we have a universal power plug and a very ridiculous location for reading materials we have the air sickness bag promotional stuff thick duty free yep adjustable headrest and of course uh, three point seat belt And by the way, you cannot use the in-flight entertainment on ground. This feels like EPA Air last year. Gentlemen, welcome to Asian Airlines Supply 745 bound for Hong Kong International Airport. Please, fasten your seatbelt and switch your electronic device with the flying mode. Also, keep back seat your bed being sore under the seat and keep lighters and power bank with you and your seat. Thank you. Good evening, and this is Captain from Friday. Ryan from Hong Kong International Airport. Thank you, and good luck.
business class laboratory of the Asian Airlines Boeing 777-200ER. It's a very classic looking laboratory here as the aircraft was built in 2002. In terms of amenities, it's kind of complete for a short flight, but well, this aircraft is also used for long haul flights such as to Europe and US. We have mouthwash here. We have uh, Logitan body lotion. Mist Combs Toothbrush Still looking very clean Very nice
So we have arrived at Hong Kong International Airport. Flight was on time relatively and we landed way ahead of schedule, approximately one hour before schedule in terms of the landing time. And we reached the gate 30 minutes behind the ticket schedule, which is nice. Overall experience, Asian Airlines, still okay. The 777-200 is a bit outdated in terms of the hard product. Um, crews were nice and friendly, IFE quite limited, and no in-flight Wi-Fi as well. However, the meal was whew, fulfilling and very nice. They can do better in terms of um, taking the order from the ground and distributing the menu on the ground, but yeah, still manageable. So after the meal, they switch off the light and let the passengers to sleep, and I had a very nice sleep. So yeah, 777 of Asia now. For regional, okay, but I think if you're flying long haul like to Rome or Europe, it's uh, not the best choice. So yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and see you on my next video.